we're looking forward to every game. You know, we go day by day, so, you know, it's just going to be a fun year. Something special happened during a fun year at Fruitland High School's football game, something that touched everyone who saw it. The seniors on the team honored the 13 U.S. service members killed in Afghanistan last month in a moment that had the entire stadium standing and wiping tears. Maggie O'Meara talked to the boys about what it meant to them and what the patriotic gesture meant to this small Idaho town in tonight's Seventh Hero. Everyone looks forward to Friday nights in Fruitland, Idaho. It's just fun to be out here with your friends and doing something that you love doing. It's just amazing. It's small town high school football at its finest. These boys have grown up together. For the most part, we've all been brothers. I mean, we've known each other since we were in kindergarten. And it's a real special thing for all of us. At a recent home game, something really powerful happened. Something that brought the whole community together. We saw like a bunch of people doing stuff for the 13 fallen soldiers and we thought we should do our own part in it. The team was touched by the tributes to the American service members we lost in Afghanistan that they had seen. They had an idea that would play out on the field. One of our uh, team families, uh, donated all the flags we had. We all walked out with a flag to the stadium and we normally do a prayer before our game. So we did a prayer and then when we lined up for the national anthem. Three, one, 12 seniors and then we grabbed uh, another junior to carry a flag out with us and then we stepped out onto the field with the 13 flags. 13 flags, one for each life lost on that terrible day. It was a beautiful and somber display of patriotism. These seniors say it felt like the right thing to do. For me, it meant um, honoring all of our fallen soldiers, not just the 13, but honoring all that have passed because everyone in this community has a tie to a military family in some way. Here, I at Fruitland, we really uh, take pride in our country. Um, uh, honestly, doing being able to do that was uh, such an honor, really, because there's not many countries where you can just go out and do and show your pride just like we can. The crowd at the game was blown away. So was the whole community. Photos and video spread quickly on social media. Well, I saw a lot of people post about it. I mean, I really feel like Fruitland was really um, touched that we did that. I think it meant everything because we were getting reactions that were off the charts. Uh, people were coming up to us after the game and throughout the school week this weekend we're like, it was a great job. You guys did a wonderful thing out there and we're like thanking us for what we did. The boys say they did this to honor all of our veterans in Idaho. We just want to thank you for your service and we greatly appreciate it. We know what you've done and sacrificed for us, you and your family, and we just hope the best for you in these times. We're um, extremely grateful for everything. These 12 seniors are inspiring a whole town. It's very um, humbling. Three, two, one. Seven zeros. Team says they plan to carry the flags out for every home game this season.